as much as we have been uh, criticizing the Congress and various state governments in the Congress for misusing the law to silence media, I think it is important for the people of our country to look at what Pindrai Vijayan is doing in Kerala. Pindrai Vijayan's CPM government, which after it took over, has been beset with scams after scams, ranging from gold smuggling to camera purchases for traffic and having his own office and his own staff and family involved in these scams has been cracking down on media repeatedly and has been using the threats of intimidation to silence media. It recently filed cases against some TV channels and the journalists in the TV channels including women journalists and this recent uh, example of using the police raiding offices and homes of journalists to silence a YouTube channel when the matter is in court and when the person has appealed to the Supreme Court. This is a YouTube channel called Maranagan Malayali. The gentleman is uh, Sajan Skarya. And to use this type of blatant intimidation from a person, chief minister and a government who by the way, criticized our government for uh, banning BBC's documentaries and talked about free speech. So in our country, if there is hypocrisy and double standards about freedom of speech, if there is a continuing politics of threat and intimidation, it is represented by the left and the Marxist government in Kerala. It is one of the reasons why all Marxist and left governments have been dispatched from all over the country Tripura, West Bengal, everywhere they have been dispatched. But in Kerala, they continue to practice this politics of intolerance, politics of intimidation and threat against our media and journalistic community. And it is absolutely unconscionable, it is absolutely unacceptable in a democracy like ours. If you like the video, do like, comment, share, and subscribe. 